you guys so i did not sleep well at all last night i was like super hot i woke up sweating and i just kept having contractions and usually i can sleep through them but i just could not sleep through them for some reason last night so i did not get like any sleep so and then i had to wake up a little bit earlier today and i went and helped brandon's mom for a few hours so this afternoon me and tex have just been relaxing and catching up on a little bit of sleep i was able to take a little bit of a nap and so now i feel a lot better so that's what i've been doing on my sunday waiting for brandon to come home he works today and he'll be home soon you look so weird is daddy gonna be home soon? Is daddy gonna be home? So Brandon is home now. He's just doing something on his truck. I have just not been feeling good again. I feel like the third trimester is gonna be really hit and miss for me on the days of when I feel good and when I don't. So that kind of stinks, but it's not like we have that much longer and it's not like I'm feeling absolutely terrible. I mean, lots of people have to deal with throwing up every day in the first trimester, so I didn't get that, so. I'm definitely not complaining, I'm very thankful, but I think that this is definitely going to be probably my worst trimester, but, so I'm not feeling the best, so I'm just going to make some cookies, we are actually already almost out of the ones that I already made, so I bought like this huge thing to make, and I'm just going to make some cookies. Okay, so the first batch is ready to go in the oven, and I find that if you make them thicker, that they end up like thicker and softer in the end. Huh, buddy? You want some cookies? They look good, huh? Should we put them in? You came in just in time for treats. <laughs> <laughs> Milk and cookies. I don't know if I'll probably have a couple, but I'm not. last time I had four in milk. I last little, night you had four. I was a little overdone. <laughs> so as I said earlier, I haven't been feeling very good. So what we're going to do tonight is we're going to show Brandon's and, and baby photos. Because you guys have, ever since we got our ultrasound done, everyone said, she looks like Brandon. So I want to show you guys Brandon's baby photos so we can really compare. We'll put them side by side yeah. and see what she might look like. And actually, Brandon, his mom told me that when he was young, he did not want to get his hair cut. So he actually looked like a really, really, and he had long, blonde hair. Now I can't stand it long. But, so he looked like a very pretty little girl, and he used to get compliments about how pretty of a little girl he was. So if she ends up looking like him, I'm definitely okay with it. <laughs> so we'll have to see them. Yay. At least your mom's not here to embarrass you with stories. Yeah. <laughs> So I had Brennan's mom give me this, and it's birth to five years, so we're going to look at them and find one that we can compare to. <laughs> yeah, probably the youngest one. So there's baby Brandon when he was just a newborn. Yeah. So that kind of looks like her. So there's Brandon that everyone thought that she looked like. I can see it. Yeah. Can you see it? The nose. Yup, it's the nose. Maybe she has my nose. There's little Brandon. Look at the car seats back then. They look so different. Here's when you started getting blonde, I think. Yeah, it must have been. Yeah, there's a good one. Oh, You were cute. I wonder how old you were then. I looked pretty young. You still look like that, like seriously. <laughs> yeah, I still have those uh, little lines right here. You still look like that. Oh look, you're smiling. <laughs> look at the swings back then too, holy moly. I know. They were like actual swings. <laughs> you're so cute, look at you. Yep. You look ginger in this one. Yeah. But that's usually how babies go blonde. You think that you look creepy in this one? <laughs> yeah, that hood. <laughs> and look at Brandon in his little cowboy boots. <laughs> yeah. We should take that same photo. Smile. 
smiley baby. That one's really cute of you and your mom. <laughs> Brandon's baby butt. Yeah, and I still have that hairline. Yeah. The widow's peak thing. You do kind of look like a girl. <laughs> in that outfit I do. <laughs> <laughs> well, like if you put a bow in, in your hair, you would have been a really cute girl. Is that your first birthday, probably? Looks like it. <laughs> With my wacky hair. Starting to grow long. There's me helping cooking. Yep, Brandon liked to cook even when he was a kid. <laughs> a baby. Yeah. He did not want his hair cut. Yeah, you definitely had long hair. And then, is that a mullet? Kind of, because she <laughs> was cutting my bang so that I could see, but she wasn't cutting the back, so it's mullet. I had wavy blonde hair. <laughs> There's you and that bear again. Yeah, oh, and there's my kitty. Is that a kitty? <laughs> you should see them. We might even still have them. They're all taped up because they're beanbag legs and stuff. <laughs> so the kitty's all taped up. Looks like you let them cut your hair. Yeah. Brandon, I, age five. I wore that outfit like every day, I remember. <laughs> that was kindergarten. Well, you are really cute as a kid. She uh, looks like you. No, I'm just ugly. No. <laughs> but you don't look like a girl anymore, so. That's good. <laughs> but yeah, do you guys think that he's going to look like her? Oh, I can't wait to see what she looks like. I think she has my nose. Mm hmm At least in this splurgy picture. Yeah. We'll see when she actually comes out she and has, she gets. I think she has your lips. Because if you look at her lower lip, it's kind of got that thing in it. Mine doesn't. My, I thing have, in it? I have a skinny lower lip. You have a bigger lower lip. I guess we'll see. I think she has your lips. I'll have to. That's about all I can tell. <laughs> <laughs> Nose and mouth. <laughs> we'll have to show you guys my baby pictures too and we'll like compare them. Yeah. But I don't have mine and my mom is far away. So. Yeah, when my mom comes up, we'll have to get my baby pictures and show you guys. I was pretty cute too. So either way, I think that she's pretty set. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I think that our next ultrasound, I don't know. I don't think that we get it. I don't know. That'd be cool to see her farther along. Yeah. Probably still would be all blurry and bulky though like this one is. Yeah, they are like that. I don't know though. I mean, we're going to meet her soon enough. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's only a couple months away. Yeah. So I guess we'll see who she really looks like. But you can't really tell when they're very first born. Yeah. We'll have to wait a little bit. But is she going to look like you? <laughs> Better not. Tex, is she going to look like you? Is she going to look like her brother? Yeah, big snout. Big floppy ears. <laughs> is she going to be really fuzzy? <laughs> and brown eyes. Hopefully not. Hopefully she doesn't look like a dog. Look, but I'm so handsome. So who do you think she's going to look like? What do you think she's gonna look like? I think she's gonna be a mix of both of us. <laughs> Judging by that little picture we have. Yep. Either way, no matter what, she's gonna be adorable. Yep. So this is a little bit of a different vlog, but since I didn't feel good, and you guys have been saying that she's gonna look like Brandon, so I just wanted to show you guys all these little cute baby pictures. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was pretty young. <laughs> But we will see you guys tomorrow. We're going to do a Q&A. Tomorrow's Q&A day, so. Q&A. Yep. I like answering <sighs> questions. It's fun. Yeah, we really like doing Q&As. Because we both like to talk. So Tex. does Tex. But we'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. night. Tex, say good night. He just winked. Did he? He's like, got you ladies. <laughs> say good night. <laughs>